Hi, I'm Dr. Jay Calvert. I'm a Beverly Hills physician and I am that Michelle is having some symptoms that what can really only be described as postpartum depression. Now, I do realize that her children are 13 years old. However, it sounds like a very prolonged case. Additionally, on her 40th birthday, it's pretty clear now that she'll be moving into a new type of depression associated with menopause, which is fine because depression just keeps continuing along. However, at least with this depression, there will be a sprinkling and smattering of hot moments. So I've been trying to date her for years. The problem is, I'm not fat, definitely not ugly, got a great job, I'm not a child. All these things add up. She obviously doesn't want to date somebody like me. Got no chance. And the best thing is that people like me, so for sure she doesn't want to date me. Michelle, please. I know, I know all the feelings, but stop chasing me. Enough is enough. Okay? Leave me alone. That, 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 that's okay. Hey Michelle, it's Kara here with The Dating Company. We're trying to find everything and fill out the surveys and we can't find anyone that's compatible. <coughs> Sorry. Man, I'm telling you, I've been living for the last two years in uh, in Park La Praia and I'm looking uh, over uh, my telescope to uh, Michelle's house and I'm telling you, this girl doesn't have nothing. I mean, literally nothing going on in her life. She just sleeps in, uh, in bed all day, doesn't go out of the house. And frankly, tell the truth, I think she's a little bit creepy. Her voice is loud, shrill, and annoying. I'm Dr. I'm Dr. Drew Warden, plastic surgeon and host of The Doctors. Now, Michelle, I keep telling you, professionally speaking, you need a little upgrade there. You know, not too much, nothing more than a medium to full C. But as I said, this is what's keeping you single. I'm Katie at the Cheesecake Factory, and I just have to say that I see Michelle all the time. She's going into every store, she'll buy something, and the next day I see her, she's returning it. She even does it here, and we're food. Um, she'll buy a, a plate off the menu, and then take a couple bites, return it, and I just gotta say, Michelle, you gotta cut it, okay? Quit it. All right, uh, happy birthday. It looks like you're a little off the dare, so uh, time to do some chuba and get back up. All right, this is Three Dog Bakery. Here we love dogs. We bake treats for dogs all day, but we hate Jessie. Jessie's never allowed here because she's an ugly, disgusting dog, and that's all there is to it. So sorry, Jessie, but you're not allowed here. Michelle sounds like a communist name. Don't like her, and I definitely don't trust her. L is for laughter. L is for loony. L is for love. I heard you're turning 40 years old, and that's really freaking old because 40 years ago, black people still had to sit at the back of the bus. 40 is old because uh, Hawaii wasn't even a state and they didn't even have color movie. 40 years ago there weren't such things as computers, um, mobile what? phones were the size of a house, pizza only cost a penny. <laughs> oh and women couldn't vote, not that they should be allowed to vote now anyway. Oh, 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 oh,
Birthday, Michelle. Happy 40th birthday. Come here and shoot your Mm-hmm. Michelle, happy birthday. Um, you're the best sister I've ever had, and I love you very much. Happy birthday. And it's my birthday. All that's left to do is uh, for our birthday wishes for Michelle. Uh, on behalf of Leo and myself, uh, we'd just like to say we love you very much. Oh, I don't love her. Okay, I, we, not, I we tolerate love, her. We tolerate you immensely. Okay. Um, we uh, enjoy your company more than anyone else um, of the people that we tolerate. We like hanging around you because it makes us look so much better and it makes us all look uh, put together and our life is in order. And we don't think that you should be depressed about the fact that you're 40 uh, because you don't look 40. You don't look, you look about You look about 39 and a half. 39 and three quarters, let's be realistic. You don't okay. have to schmooze, okay? All right. Uh, 39 and three quarters. Um, so you look good for your age. We love you. And um, we hope you have and a happy birthday. Happy birthday. Oh, let me switch this thing off. Good night, good luck. There we go. All right, you think she's going to like it? <sighs> she's a pain in the ass. She's going to drive us mad. The, girl, so, the girl's desperate these days, by the way. Um, Don't look at me. You, it's, if think, someone's gonna make really happy, needs to get laid. I think you have to take one for the team. I think you need to sleep with her. I'm not sleeping with her. You should sleep with her. Oh my god, I'd rather kill myself. I'd rather cheese grate my own face. I'd rather staple my balls to my head and allow you to use it as a punching bag. Hmm. Well, listen, someone's gonna have to do something. The situation is getting, I mean... She's literally like... Uh, she looks terrible. She looks old. She looks horrible. She's got varicose veins coming on her legs. I mean, I really, I can't even like, I see her as a guy. Literally, she's like one of the boys. And you know what? I only did this whole presentation and this video. Is, Did you feel bad? No, 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 no. I did it so it should be about me. I want everyone to see I did a great movie. I did a great thing. It's funny. It is. It's about me. I don't give a shit about her 40th birthday anyway. As long as people say, Leo, it's funny. I'm happy, everyone's happy, all done. Everyone, one, two, three, done. <laughs>